So at this point here, we're staining. No, we're our, putting the gloss. The seal. Yeah. Oh, it's a seal? It's a seal. Yeah, that's what we're doing. And right here, you can see what it is. Clear finish gloss, water-based. Can you tell them why I'm using a cloth and not a brush? Hmm. <laughs> not a brush? We're out of brushes, guys. Yep. Well, this is very thin, though, so to even use a brush on this might be a little funny. As you can see, different clothes, different day. We didn't uh, do it all in one shot, but well, that's how that's how life goes, right? But anyways, um, I'm going to put up this rack right now, and we're going to be using this for hanging clothes and stuff like that in the laundry room. We don't want to do old school clothes, clothes line or nothing like that. So I'm going to mount it in here, and this is how it works. And once it's up, you have the ability to collapse it down. That's what I'm doing. You got it from Amazon. Amazon. Right, pretty strong. So that's it. Pretty simple. Pretty neat. All right. For example. dry your clothes yes. and you can also put it through here as well or if you have too much and you need an end there you go so you got three options of how to hang it and once you're done you don't want to be hitting your head or anything like that simply collapse it down can you open the cupboard to see how close yeah for sure oh okay good cool. okay good 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 did we get more than one in the pack did we, we did so, so we're only gonna use one, right? Yeah, we only need one. Um, if we find that we need two, we'll put it up in the future. All right, so that's done. Next, we're gonna move on to, I guess. We have to figure out. Oh, I bought new um, handles for the for the cupboard right. to match um, the black down here. So let's take that out and change that. All right, so. Home Depot. Home Depot, we were in there earlier today. These are the hooks, and we place them. Not hooks, those are hooks. Handles. the handles. Sorry, and they'll re. Ooh. Too big? Too big. No! They are not the same size. Oh my god! <laughs> I would have to read you, no. and you have a hole there, so it wouldn't look good. So I have to get the other size. Yeah, so we gotta go back. Oh, okay, can you take that one off, and at least I'll bring it with me to Home Depot? Yeah. Because I was thinking, I don't know if you're up for it, but you want to go to Ikea? Quickly. Sure. So upset. Pushing the yellow button on top. This? Yes, push it all the way in. This one? Yes.
So we stained and sealed these strips. I'm not sure if you guys have used these before, but we're going to cover the the wood, the panel. What do you want to call it? Want to grab the scissors to cut after? Yeah, let's um. You're gonna do the legs first. So it pulls to what? The lower part. Sure. Yeah, this is so you know how to cut. Give it a little extra because I don't think that end is cut even. One thing you guys will notice is that we didn't think about staining in here. I'm okay with living with that imperfection, but some of you guys may not. So if you ever decide to do this project, then you have to paint both sides. Same thing with this. We didn't do it on that side. 